Hello everyone and welcome to the RV Inspection and Care podcast and video. I'm Dwayne, I'm the Certified RV Inspector and today we're going to be talking about the top 5 RV buying mistakes that many consumers make. Now there have been lots of new RVers that have bought RVs in the past few years and many have made some very bad choices when they entered either the new or the used RV market. And what this resulted in was getting RVs that were problems and therefore they were not happy with the results of their buying experience. So today, we're going to discuss five big mistakes that many people make that need to be avoided to make sure that the RV you get is a good one. Let's start with number five, and that is many people don't learn much about RVs themselves before going out and actually buying one. They often fall in love with the lifestyle. This is constantly promoted by the manufacturers, by online content creators that are just pushing the travel section of it and the adventure of it all, the freedom and so on and they're in love with that whole idea but they don't really pay very much attention to the vehicle that's going to allow them to enjoy that lifestyle. So before you actually buy that vehicle, you need to learn about the pros and the cons of different kinds of RVs or different categories. There is no one RV that fits everybody's needs out there. So you need to learn about these categories and determine what's going to fit you best. Another thing that needs to be learned about is what brands are known for producing better quality than their competition and that way you can put the odds on your side that you're going to get a good RV. Also it's a good practice to not only watch videos and content about adventure and travel but also about maintaining RVs, learning what they're about, being able to spot trouble in major costly components in an RV. So that way when you're pre-inspecting the RVs you're looking at you can spot a problem RV in many cases and eliminate it right away. Alright, so now let's move on to our second big mistake a lot of people make, and that is they base their whole buying decision on more or less superficial reasons. In other words some people just buy on price they want to get the least expensive that they can get, others are looking for the right color, they're looking for the right floor plan, the layout of the RV. Now let me be clear these are good things to consider you don't want to ignore that. They should not be the sole reason why someone has bought an RV that's more or less superficial and believe me the frustration that you're going to feel with a poor quality RV after you bought it is going to override all the appearance and the price and all those other reasons why you did actually buy it. You'll be very unhappy even if it does have the floor plan you want at the price you wanted to pay. Alright, let's move on to the third mistake many people make and that is that they put too much trust in what the dealer or the seller of an RV is telling them. Now let me emphasize this dealers know how to get sales quickly. Well instead of going to the very back of the repair line the dealer is now most likely going to put you right in the front of the line because they want the money from the RV sale, they want that RV off their lot, they want the money so they're going to start fixing things very quickly and then when all things have been fixed according to your satisfaction you can complete that deal and you'll have a good RV. Now these are the top 5 mistakes that I see people making over and over again. There doesn't have to be a lot of complaints about RVs like there are. Yes it's true that RV manufacturers bear a certain responsibility, RV dealers bear a certain responsibility for the shape of the RV industry at this point. But you can actually work around a lot of those issues, if you know the mistakes you need to avoid, and how you should buy an RV to make sure that you have an RV that you're happy with, not only now but for many years to come. And that's it for now. Have safe and happy travels my friends. Until next time.